Good morning, Wilson Sea Lions. Hi, I'm Ashton. And I'm Savannah, and we are your hosts for the KWES News Show. Today is Wednesday, March 11th, 2020, and it is day one on rotation schedule. The weather will have will have mostly cloudy with a part of with a high of 56 degrees. We have a lot of announcements today, but before we get started, let's stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the moment of silence. Please repeat the hero pledge after me. I pledge to be helpful. I, I pledge, pledge to be helpful. While engaged in my education. While, while engaged, engaged in my education. education. Showing respect to others. Showing respect to others. And remaining organized. And remaining organized. The choice is mine. The choice, the choice is mine. I choose to be a hero. I choose to be a hero. We have the following birthdays today. K Caleb, Galicia, Sh Sh Shermaine Reyes and Gianna Ribeira Brigado. Happy birthday. I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name. Please come down to the office to get your special birthday spirit stick. Today's lunch we serve chicken teriyaki with rice and dinner roll. Ham and cheese polo bar bread sticks or sunrise sandwich and cheese stick with crackers. And now on to special announcements. Hi, I'm Fizo and I'm Sienna with today's special announcements. PTO's movie night is Friday, March 20th. Yay! Featuring Frozen 2. Pre-order sales for food are due this Friday. Wilson Walk shirts are now on sale. Make sure you order your shirt online before March 22nd. Yearbooks are now on sale. Reserve your copy today by ordering online or turning in your paper form. Our house meetings are on this are this Friday. Be sure to wear your house to show your house spirit by wearing your house shirt. Do you want a rain, rainbow snow cone for St. Patrick's Day? If you do, be sure to get your order of two dollars and by this Friday, the 13th. We will have a tech showcase night on Tuesday, March 31st. More details coming soon, but, but, but be sure to save the date. Hi, I'm Madeline with a special feature. I'm introducing the winners of the Freedom Writers Contest in Mrs. Brooks and Mrs. Huge fifth grade classes. They have to write a five paragraph essay on what freedom means to them. All of the students did a remarkable job, job but four winners were selected. Congratulations to Diego Cerns, Sydney Royal, Kelsey Sadai, and Michaela Jones. Michaela won first place and a Sweet Frog gift card. She will be reading her essay now. Hi, I'm Michaela, and this is what freedom means to me. When you look up the word freedom in Webster's Dictionary, it says a state of exemption from the power or control of another. And while that is correct, it also means so much more to me. Freedom means to love, to laugh, to play, to sing, to dance, to cry, and to do so much more wherever, whenever, and with whomever. Freedom means that nobody should be judged or held back just because of the things that make them unique or different from everybody else. Albert Camus once said, freedom is nothing but a chance to be better. I can't even begin to say how true that is. Freedom is what leads us through those hard times and helps us to continue to thrive at our best. Freedom is the pathway to success. When you think about how you want to live your life, you most likely want to live it to your fullest. You want to accomplish all your goals and be happy and safe. Everybody around you probably wants the same thing. We all have ideas and goals and dreams. That's exactly why we can't hold each other back. Hatred and discrimination must stop if you want to get anywhere in our world. Martin Luther King was and still is an ambassador of freedom. As soon as he said, I have a dream, many other people had dreams too, maybe even the same dream. Martin Luther King had courage to stand up for what he wanted. Forgiveness to those who treated him wrong and love because he believed that everybody, no matter what, deserved it. 
I believe that if we can find all of that in our hearts, freedom will come through to us. Freedom has a definition in the dictionary that is technically correct, but freedom is not just physical. It's mental and emotional. Freedom is being comfortable in your own skin, thoughts, and environment. That's what freedom means to me. Hi, I'm Sydney with your Warm Thought Wednesday. If you have the power to make someone happy, do it. We need more of that in this world. Thank you for all the great updates. Please continue to show your best pure behavior. Have, have a, a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday! Wednesday.